like having seen your career of fair bit uh, one of my i couldn't watch it but one of my finest memories would be that century, uh, century that you scored in the test in uh, mysore i think it was uh, there is a test match this year and you announced your retirement just before that was there any temptation to you know sort of like you know play that test match because it's been a while eight years uh, now so was there a temptation Yes, it, <laughs> it did go through my mind, but I think where I'm at, is my, I felt like I don't have the patience for that anymore. <laughs> Playing a lot of T20 cricket over the past few years, is actually, it's such a short and quick format. I t- actually kind of felt like even the 50-over game sometimes, I just wanted to come in and get going from ball one. So um, there is a danger to that. And you know what? Um, I've got a very special memory from my first test and the only test I've played, I managed to score my maiden 100. And you know, I thought, well, why not finish while I'm on top, you know? So, <laughs> um, no regrets, but I'm, I'm really excited to see that. Um, I mean, somebody like Laura Wolfard, she just loves batting. So for her to be able to do that probably for four, four days, um, I can't wait to watch her play. And there's quite a few of the other youngsters that wasn't part of the team eight years ago when when we played in, in the test match. And I think it's, it's time for them to get that opportunity too. 